the offensive of the Russian army in Donetsk began to decline. On the 385th day of Ukraine-Russia war, clashes between Ukrainian army and Russian army continue. The Russian army continues to inflict heavy losses in Donetsk region. According to the incoming information, the Russian attacks in Donetsk have decreased because the Russian army has no ammunition to make strong attacks. Oleksiy Dmitrychevsky, spokesman for the Joint Center of Defense Forces, said on Ukrainian national television that the Russian offensive near Donetsk is nearing its climax as Russia's occupying forces are suffering serious losses and ammunition shortages. In fact, the enemy's resources have expired, compared to last week. The enemy has significantly reduced the number of assaults, the amount of shelling. Dmitrychevsky said, Mitrochevsky said that in the previous week, the Russian army carried out 600 artillery shelling and about 100 attacks per day, while last week, 250 artillery shelling and 30 attacks took place every day. Dmitrychevsky said that in order to continue the offensive, Russia would need time for the occupation forces to recover. He said the occupiers had limited shells they could use. If they exceeded it, they'd run out of ammunition the next day. And this is a problem not only for Prigozhin, who says that he is not given ammunition. This is a common problem in Russian army. The enemy, in my opinion, has already spent its powder and does not have the power it had previously, he said. To reach all the actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.